Hey, it's your boy DJ Wolf here live. Uh, sort of. <laughs> Any case, I was uh, reading and I also saw a couple of videos posted on YouTube and other media so- sources that uh, Oprah Winfrey, you know, Negro woman from the South. She actually is. This is from my, my parents' home state of Mississippi. She, uh, she was interviewing a, a program recently and was talking about her running for possible run for president in 2020. In a way, I'm not really surprised that, that she she was asked about that. She was actually pondering about it. Now, whether she actually does it or not is another story. She very well could. Not sure if there was any real reason why she should, but she probably well could. And I think the Democrats would 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 uh, would love it. If she tried anything to try to uh, keep Trump from running a second term, in terms of that, the thing is, is she just going to be another uh, popular person running for president just because she can? Yeah, likely if she did. Do I care? If she runs? No, I don't, because I don't think she's going to do any different than anybody else. But, I don't know. I think it would just be uh, just to put another feather in the cap. You know, she, Oprah Winfrey is worth billions. She is the highest, uh, well, put like this, she is like the wealthiest black woman on the planet. She's the only black person that I know, and from what I read, that's worth billions. Okay? So, I don't know. I, I, I think it would be more of a popularity contest if she won. If she, I mean, if she ran. I, I think it would be the same old, same old. And like somebody said, at least with Donald Trump, not that I'm on his side, or anything. At least with Donald Trump, you kind of know what you're getting. You don't really know what you're getting if if you if you deal with her. And there's going to be a political vehicle behind her anyway. Tell her what she should do and what she shouldn't do. Kind of like just like Obama, really. And really, the people who are hurt the most, man, are our people. Every time some political candidate tries to sweep you off your feet and promising you the world, you get left in the dust once they get around. Kind of like what Trump doing with his constituents now. Pretty much the same thing. <clears throat> Except those one percenters. My thing is, politicians... With money, usually are the ones that always get, uh, are the ones that control everything anyway. That's been proven. Or somebody who had big money behind them. Those are the ones that get control. You know, here Donald Trump talking about draining the swamp. He's part of the swamp that needs to be drained out. You know. And, and I mean it in a mild way because he's the very big leaguers who want who who wants to control your mindset. It's the same dude who's telling you that the media is fake, and he's telling you falsehoods on all kind of shit. But he's going to criticize the media. Really, you of all people, you're part of the media. Remember? The Apprentice? Yeah. 
prime example, but yet you're going to tell people, oh yeah, the me is fake. Remember? You were part of NBC at one point, and you were talking about the media being fake. You're a hypocrite. Total. Totally a hypocrite. That's what he is. If you're going to drain swamp, start with yourself. Because you are the biggest hypocrite and fake guy I've seen ever. You know? There's just so much I want to say, but I get so angry just thinking about all the stupid shit that he's doing and saying right now. It's not even funny. I just right I just I just shake my head. So just wanted to get it out of the way. I Oprah Winfrey as far as her running or not. I don't know. I think it's all a bunch of I think it's just people just trying to sell wolf tickets. That's all. That's all it is. Just like Donald Trump, he's selling wolf tickets now. He's selling wolf tickets as we speak. You know. Politics the politics is nothing but a, a money a money train. That's all it is. It's about the money and the power. It's not about the people. It's not about the will of the people. It's about the will of the almighty power and the will of the almighty dollar and who controls it. Period. This is DJ Wolf. That's all I got to say for right now. Of course, questions and comments. I can reach that for all to hear on Twitter. For all to hear TV on YouTube, of course. DJ Wolf online at yahoo.com is my email. And DJ Wolf Live on Facebook. This is DJ Wolf. That's all I got to say right now. I got more to say about this and other stuff on the back burner. Hope to do a show this weekend. <laughs> Live and taped. Talk to you later.